Okay, let's win ourselves this Elimination Chamber match. Oh! Come on, somebody take care of them. Yeah, you two idiots fight it out. I'm just gonna taunt. Oh, come on, Goldberg, seriously? Oh, that was a huge spear. I mean, I need to build up as many finishes as I can so I can knock him out if I have to. Or try to, that is. Come on, Steve. Keep beating the crap out of him. Signature move by Steve right there. Jesus. Goldberg is like an attacking machine right now. Boom! Boom! <laughs> I'll steal the pin. Oh no, he kicked out. Run! Run! No! <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Seriously? I'm going for a finisher and you're going to try to stop me? Goldberg's gonna have to do a finisher on him. If Goldberg hits his finisher on him, I think he's done. Getting pretty brutal. Can I get a fourth finisher? Sure, why not? Come on, will you idiots do something? I'm only gonna let this go for so much longer before I. Oh my god, did you see that? He backdropped him into the freaking glass. Oh man. Okay, come on guys, do something here. Do a finisher or something. Same move again, Goldberg, seriously. Do something to him. Oh, so you're gonna come after me. I didn't want to climb out there. Sorry, Steve. I'll have to take care of you myself. Hopefully this is enough to make him tap. Yeah, he's done.
What is he doing? No! Oh, come on. If he hits his finisher on me, dude, I am done. Seriously, Goldberg? Come on, tap out. I used all my finishers. Yes, come on. So close. Come on. Yes. Awesome. Good God. That was so close. I knew if he hit his finisher once, I was done and out. Jericho picks up one hell of a victory. He is the only survivor in this chamber of mass punishment. It was indeed a steel hell. What a match. There were no friends or allies in this match. It seems like this faction business has been finished once and for all. I think they realize that a championship is more important in the long run. So is that the end of that story? You did a good job, Jericho. You were in high gear and Survivor Series was great. By the way, I would like you to challenge for the World Heavyweight title. What do you think? Are you okay with that? Yes, I'll challenge for that. Great, I knew you'd say that. Well, get some rest. Oh, there we go. I was going to ask the challenge for the world title anyways. Pretty cool. We are in Hartford, Connecticut. McMahon's in the ring again. We've had a lot of things happen here recently in the WWE, but that is all behind us now. We already have taken the next step toward the new year. So tonight, to start things off, we are going to decide a number one contender. There will be a number one contender tournament, and the last one to survive will be the number one contender. So the first challenger in the tournament will be Chris Jericho. Jericho takes on the first match. It's going to be a huge opportunity, but it's a hard accomplishment as well. Yes, to be number one contender, you have to win all three of the tournament matches. Makes sense. I'll win the three matches. That should lead me up to the pay-per-view, or I guess I'll win it. Hopefully. Chris Jericho versus Test. I'm liking the blue tights. If I win this world title, I'll be Tag Team Champ, Intercontinental Champ, and World Heavyweight Champ. Wow. Test, another wrestler who died young. Shame. Kick him in the head. Really? Really, Tess.
Oh, that was the wrong button. Dang it, I missed. Missed again. Aha. Uh -huh. I must never get that to work. That was shocking. Nice. We'll taunt him. Okay. Oh, I gotta face Kevin Nash now too. All I gotta do all three matches this like like one night. Hey, Lita. It's kind of a lot of matches for one night. Oh, look how strong the Jericho is. Holy crap. Kevin Nash, get your old ass out of here. Oh, wow. <laughs> Jericho showing everybody how strong he is. Jeez.